So often we find ourselves in a world where it's absolutely performance driven and it's results driven and you've just got to be 100% yourself all the time to achieve 100% all the time. But it's not really like that. I think we need to start realizing that we need to celebrate effort even if we didn't reach our ultimate goal. The thing is this, you know, when, when I was in school, and I don't know about you guys, but when I was in school, my teacher used to circle my failures, like four out of 10, big red circle around it. And she used to actually highlight what I failed. She never really highlighted what I did well. And I think to myself, sometimes we like that as adults as well, is we highlight our failures. We circle what we keep getting wrong and we go over that, over that, over that the whole time. Instead of saying, hey, what if we were to celebrate effort? Yes, I only got four out of 10 perhaps, but I got four out of 10. If she taught me a little bit differently or if she energized me just a little bit more, maybe I would have got six, maybe I would have got eight. Who knows, I could have even got 10 out of 10. So let's start celebrating the effort. Let's start saying, hey, listen, what about those small things that we get right every day? Have we reached our ultimate goal yet? No, not at all. But instead of circling the failure, let's start circling the effort and celebrating what people actually get right in their lives versus what we always just get wrong.